I had a little grab of hold, I'd wind it round and round, and with a sharpish needle it made a cheerful sound. And then they amplified it, it was much louder then, and you sharpened fiber needles to make it soft again. <laughs> Today for reproduction, I'm as eager as can be. Count me among the faithful fans of high fidelity. High fidelity, high five is the thing for me. With an LP disc and an FM set and a corner reflex cabinet. High frequency range, complete with auto change. All the highest notes, neither sharp nor flat. The ear can't hear as high as that. Still, I ought to please any passing bat with my <laughs> high <laughs> Who made this circuit up for you anyway? You bought it in a shop? Ooh, what a terrible job. You've got your negative feedback coupled in with your push-pull input-output. Take that across through your redhead pickup to your tweeter. If you're modding more than eight, you're going to get wow on your top. You try to bring that down through your rumble filter to your woofer. What'll you get? Flutter on your bottom. <laughs> FFRR for me. I've an opera here that you shan't escape on miles and miles of recording tape. High decibel gain is easy to obtain with a tone control at a single touch. I can make Caruso sound like Hutch. <laughs> then I, I never did care for music much. It's the high fidelity. fidelity.